What is going on guys? It is Alex and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys the RC2 car glitch on GTA Online. So if you're watching this video, chances are you're coming from my F1 guy that wasn't very clear in the second half and you already have your RC car with the modifications transferred. If you do not have your RC car with either the F1 tires or Benny tires, you need to go back into a car to RC video or go back to my F1 tire full guide. It's somewhere in the first half of that video. So the requirements are as follows, is modified RC car, X80 Proto, and your facility or the Arena War facility needs to be filled with all the cars that you want to do the F1 tires on. So for me, I only want to do it on this Apocalypse over here, so that's it. So I'm going to get into my X80 Proto and go into the mod shop now. And once you get in the mod shop, you're going to exit the vehicle. When you exit the vehicle, you're going to see that your door falls off. The driver's side usually falls over face down and the passenger side falls over face up. So that's the driver's side falling off that way. Passenger side will likely fall off the other way, depending on what type of day it's having. See, just like that. It doesn't really matter either way it falls over. Um, just get either one and make your way to the mechanic. So yeah, if it falls over the other way, you can just uh, run into it. Like let's say it's like that you're just going to keep running into it and banging against stuff and then it'll end up flipping itself back over so yeah so i'm gonna get the mechanic into like a corner of the car standing here kind of something like this not that far up kind of like right here is where i'm going to aim for so i will see you guys then i'm going to fast forward the process because i don't want this to take forever when it doesn't need to so i'll see you guys when the mechanic is here All right, you guys, you can now see that my mechanic is facing the direction just like this, and he is in a back corner of the car. It does not matter if it is the driver or the passenger side. He just has to be in the back corner. So I do recommend he faces the way that my character is now, the way the mechanic is also facing, instead of this way, because it makes it easier for this second part of this glitch. So when you believe your mechanic is in a good position, you can just exit the mod shop and put your car back in storage by pressing left D-pad. If you drive outside, that will reset the mechanic's position. Okay, so now you're just gonna get into the car that you want to put the F1 or Benny's wheels on and get it into the mod shop. One thing I could recommend is just keep your finger away from RT so you don't accidentally hit it because I've recorded this video a few times and I kept messing up a few times. So you're gonna back out, exit the vehicle, and you will be able to test it by going to the back corner just like this if you press Y and your character walks in place and then glitches into the car like that, you are good. If not, then just put this car back in storage, go get your X80 and move the mechanic a little bit over either way as needed. Okay, so now once you have that, I recommend clearing all of your jobs out and then calling Simeon for a mission. You don't want to use a Lester mission because that will likely teleport you to your facility or your apartment and that will move the mechanic and just mess everything up. So. Don't do a Lester job. So yeah. So once you get that Simeon job, you're just gonna go to your RC car. This doesn't have to be in order. You see, now I have the Simeon job. You're just gonna go to your RC car and just go into one of the menus and just hover around. You don't have to buy anything. Just hover around the menus and then exit the workshop. Now this is the part in my video that I missed pretty well. I, I was kind of in a rush to do it and I didn't really get it well. So the process is you press Y and while your character is walking up, you're going to open your phone, go to the Simeon job, press your start button, then let go, and press A immediately after. That should get you in the pause menu, but you should hear a click. That click is the job opening. You're going to hold down left D-pad, and right when you predict your character is about to get out of the car, you're going to press the start button to get rid of the menu, and keep spamming left D-pad. I just said a lot fast, but you got to see it in action a few times to see it work. So, look, I'm going to press Y, go to the Simeon, and you see my character kind of just glitched around. I didn't, I didn't really like how that went, so I kind of just gave up. I didn't really think the glitch was going to hit anyway. So, if you miss and your character just gets out of the car like that, you're just simply going to quit out of this mission and try again. Go back to the mechanic, Simeon, perfect, just like that, and that's when you know you did it right. 
at this point guys the video would be done but i am going to do the glitch one more time so that you guys can see it but make sure you do get back in your car now and go back inside and just edit something on the car a lot of people forgot to do that and they say the f1 tire glitch didn't stick to their car and it didn't really work you need to make sure you get back in the car and go and change something okay so it doesn't really matter what it is it could be cheap it could be expensive you could fully customize the car you want right now just make sure you go back and change something so i'm going to change the color um i don't know what i want to change it to let's just go ultra blue whatever i'm gonna end up making this car look good for the thumbnail anyway so right now i'm just going to exit the vehicle and i'm going to show you guys one more time just because i know it can be a little bit confusing i'm just going to go and probably my little voodoo over there and show you guys how to do it one more time okay so let's say you want to do another car you just get it into the mod shop some cars require the mechanic to be moved a little bit like i won't be surprised if this elegy requires me to move my mechanic over a little bit so we'll see so you're going to exit the vehicle it looks like i'll actually be good so yep i'll be good okay so since you just customized your car you want to just go back to the bandito again and scroll through the menu doesn't matter which menu just scroll through it and exit the workshop go back to the mechanic start a and just like that you got the glitch again so remember you have to take your car back into the mod shop and change something on it for the glitch to save so yeah guys that's the glitch that's another f1 elegy that's an f1 sand king that's my f1 half track that's my f1 i don't even i, I still don't even know what the car's name is i just bought it because it looks cool so yeah guys that's the F1 uh, part two tutorial because I cannot explain anything from my life in my other video. So I appreciate you guys for watching. Please subscribe if you can. It'll really help me out with getting my channel farther than I really expected it to go from the beginning. So appreciate you guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Peace.